standard 11-inch rotor setup. Eris Van Bibber is the sales manager for Aerospace Components. The St. Petersburg company once built aeronautical parts for the military, but now makes high-performance parts for drag racers. Van Bibber is in a Naval Reserve unit and saw duty in Iraq. I was here nine years before uh, I went to Iraq, and I definitely wanted to come back here. I love building race cars and working with the race car family. When he returned, however, things had changed. Basically, they had to reteach me, hey, this is our new product. This is what we got to get you up to speed on. And uh, by the way, we changed your software when you left, so uh, we got to show you how to reoperate your computer again because uh, you're not going to know how to get to any of your customers. The company wanted to hire him back, but retraining was costly. That's where the SuperVets program came in. It's run by WorkNet Pinellas, the county's job training and placement service. WorkNet's Dana Radio told me the program helps returning Iraq veterans. What we're trying to do right now is, is to get them back into the workforce as soon as they come back. During the past 10 years, this company has employed about 20 veterans. The SuperVets program now makes it easier for them to continue to do that. Kim Cussey, who founded the company with her husband, was eager to hire Van Biver back. Well, we are proud supporters of our troops, and we know that they are fighting for our freedom, and we know they make awesome employees. The company hopes to expand and hire more veterans. The SuperVets program will be an incentive. In St. Petersburg, I'm Rod Challenger, News Channel 8. And if the SuperVets program is successful, it may be put into place nationwide. During the last six months, it helped 70 veterans land jobs.